Hey guys, it's Yoon with the Air Zoo. Check out this artifact we have in the Air Zoo's collection. It's a Riedel starter, and it's a small 10 horsepower two-stroke engine with a pull start to get it going. Very similar to the engine that you might find on your lawnmower. Now, that sounds a little bit boring, but did you know that you could find two of these engines on the German Messerschmitt ME262, the world's first operational jet-powered fighter aircraft? These small engines, designed by German engineer Norbert Riedel, could be found in the front nose cone of the ME262's two Junker Jumo 004 turbojet engines. They were used as an engine starter, providing the initial power needed to get the two big turbojets up and running under their own power. On the ME262, the Riedel starter would be electronically started, or if needed, manually with a pull start accessed through a hole in the jet's front nose cones. This type of starter was used in all three of Germany's World War II jet engines. The BMW 003, the Junkers Jumo 004, and the Heinkel HES 011. The Riedel starter is very similar to the SR71 start car, which often used two Buick nail heads as starter motors for the aircraft's Pratt & Whitney J58 engines. The main difference being that those engines stayed on the ground while the Riedel was integrated into the airframe itself. This particular Riedel starter was donated to the Air Zoo in 2002 by a donor who received it from a World War II veteran. He took the engine as a unique and very interesting souvenir of his service in Germany. 